Hey guys! Hello, so today I am going to be drawing some of my favorite original characters. If you do not know, here I am drawing one line to divide a space for my first one, and his name is Ferris. He is probably one of my most weirdest ones, as he has awkward shapes from different OCs that I have drawn and never wanted to use, as they were horrible. As you can see, once I get far enough, he is going to be getting a top hat. That was from a Abe Lincoln character-based person, and I never really uploaded it or took it, as people might have used it in a different way and thought it was different. This is my favorite one. Because he was weird and easy to draw, to be honest. All of them have an egg-shaped body, so deal with it. So, yeah, just deal with it. I will leave a link in the description to the video game that I have added him in, but if you're wondering why his leg is dangling, it is because he normally hangs from the ceiling. Athena, we all know you exist. You don't need to be on the camera. You may see that his hands look like gigantic butcher knives that had nothing to do with any of my other characters. And he has one arm on the other side that holds a character, and it's kind of based off of Bonnie, and it holds a blade too. So, that is just a funny thing that I have added. It makes it really weird too, to be honest. And as we go into the next one, I have readjusted it, and now we are doing Zerg. He was my first one, and the most beat-up looking one. Luckily, my teacher did not assign enough work, so I had time to do this. By the way, if you were watching teachers, do not feel like it was you. I know who it was, and I thank you. Do not feel bad, please. The cool thing was... That he was the one that started off as a mutant scratch cat and then turned into Zerg. Fun fact I was going to call him Mutant Scratch until parts of his code in the game I was coding was not working and I slammed my hand on the keyboard, causing his name to switch to Zerg. Believe it or not, I am not too fond of this one. And he falls in my second on my favorite. He was based off of Foxy from the real FNAF. But the cat switched version. That is just plain weird. I almost forgot the whiskers. As you will see in a few minutes. I will remember that the whiskers on this cat exist. Um, we'll just be waiting a few minutes, and you'll see real soon that I forgot the whiskers. Hey Brian, do you know that whiskers exist on Zerg? It'd be time now that you add it! Okay, I guess he's not doing it. He's just going to keep drawing his arm and his hook.
Oh yeah, Brian, you remember the, the remember the robotic arm sticking out of the side of his head and the wire, but you don't remember the whiskers. <laughs> He's adding the whiskers! Good job for that great achievement. I do not like him as much as I do any of the other ones, but if I had to choose him over one, I'd definitely choose him over a different one. Brian, that is a jelly bean. Good job. You erased it. Okay. This one kind of reminds me of Bonnie from Five Nights at Freddy's 1. And two, I guess, because they kind of look familiar. But one's a lighter blue and one's a purple. But as I'm getting the eyes here, I'm going to start doing the ears. And this is where it really starts to look like one of the Bonnies. Although I know either one of them has two flops, not just one. Or are they both like that? I'm not 100% sure. I've played the game and I'm currently working on 2020-2020 mode, but I still do not know if he has two flaps as his ears. So now we are moving on to the egg-shaped body like all of the rest of them have. And now we're going to move on to the arms. The arms kind of seem a little weird, and I'll tell you why once I get to that point. But I'm just going to add the little belly part in. And now I'm doing one of the arms. This arm is kind of weird because it's supposed to be like a scissor type shape, but with blades on them. <laughs> I know, that's kind of weird. Just like the Ferris having butcher knives on the sides instead of his hands. So now I'm going to add the whiskers. Ooh, good, but I didn't add the whiskers falling down on his face. Okay, now I'm doing the waist though. That's good that I'm doing the waist. Rapid light change. Yeah, my light started dying and I had to clear out some memory on my phone to be able to do this part. But I just left it on for some dumb reason. Now as I do the feet, they go off screen. And I should have just told myself to scoot up the paper. But I got too distracted and I just kept drawing not looking at the camera. But luckily I zoom in. And I tried to do that 3D eye thing where you can, like, see into the eye sockets, but that didn't work out. So, now here's your good shot at the feet. Here's Zerg. He's supposed to be a cat. Totter is supposed to be a mouse, if you couldn't tell. And Ferret is a ferret. Makes sense, right? That will be it. Bye!